In a historic move, the Boy Scouts of America is rebranding, now continuing their efforts to be even more inclusive. Five years ago, the organization started allowing girls to join Boy Scouts. Now they're changing their name to Scouting America. Kate Hab's Ashley Barr speaking with a Boy Scout and a Scout executive about what they think about this change. Tonight's top story. Since 1910, Boy Scouts of America has raised boys into young men. First class, second class, star, life, eagle. <laughs> but Isabella McCutcheon is part of a larger trend. This is one out of 50. <laughs> Getting girls into Boy Scouts. Rebranding came, came about basically because you have so many f females joining scouting right now. Girls showing they can do the same thing boys do. The boys are like, they are like, oh, these girls are whooping our butts. <laughs> we got a tail end it. <laughs> As Abling's first girl to join the ranks of Boy Scouts, she says facing criticism is nothing new to her. Oh, you're in, you're in a guys program. Like, why are, why are you here? Like, you just got to push past that. Deciding Girl Scouts wasn't for her. And Boy Scouts would talk about how they went camping, how they went rock climbing, hiking, all of this outdoorsy stuff. This is my troop number, Troop 306. Mark Conrad shares for years he's noticed a need for Boy Scouts to expand. How many times families would come to a Cub Scout meeting and they'd have their daughters with them but they couldn't participate because they couldn't be part of the program. Now changing even more by changing its name to Scouting America. Girls were, came into the, the old Boy Scout program called Scouts BSA now. So, uh, so it just made, made sense. Isabella interested to see what the change will look like. I feel like it's definitely going to sound more inclusive. Yet again, I also feel like it's taking away from the history of the program. Adding the name change will show girls and all are welcome. Beneficial for getting more girls into the program and for allowing it to seem more diverse and because it is. Um, this is the shirt, the standardized shirt. In Abilene, with coverage you can count on, Ashley Ibarra, KTAB News. Thank you, Ashley and Isabella. The name change will not take effect officially until February the 8th, 2025. That is the 115th birthday of the scouting organization.